Qatar Airways says it's the revolutionary new first in business class experience. Let's see in our in-flight video whether that's true. One thing in advance, this flight was paid by ourselves. Qatar Airways had no knowledge of our review and did not compensate us. Hey guys, it's me Dominic. I'm here in the new Qatar Airways Q Suite and I will fly with Stefan from Doha to London and show you the first in business. First of all, the pros. Yes, there are tons of privacy. With privacy panels that stow away, allowing passengers in adjoining seats to create their own private room. Absolutely fantastic food. Qatar Airways surpasses its own business class in the Q Suite. Yeah, thank you. This is the business class menu for today. There's some ah, okay. for the wine list. Yeah. This is the Castello Monte, ah. which is here. Okay. Top-notch entertainment and amenities, a double bed in the middle seats, extra fluffy pillows and blankets and a service you only get in a first class. There's just one thing missing. Wi-Fi on board is not available yet on the 777. The business class cabin consists of two parts, 24 seats in the forward cabin and 18 in the rear cabin. That's a total of 42 business class seats. Cabin interiors are designed in Qatar Airways signature colors of burgundy and grey, enhanced with elegant and warm rose gold detailing. The seats have been thoughtful dressed in the latest and finest fabrics to optimize the comfort. One thing that is unique to the Q Suite is the quad arrangement. Whether traveling with family, friends or business colleagues, movable panels will allow to transform the space into a social area allowing to work, dine or socialize. And when I wish to relax or sleep, a crew member transforms the space back into my own private room. On my flight, this used a family with two children. The screens were pushed aside, creating a huge space. Absolutely unique in business class. For our flight, we choose two seats at the window. For solo travelers anyway, the better choice. Again, a seat against and a seat with the direction of flight is executed. It is not a strange feeling to sit against the direction of flight. The media panel also comes with an all-access power port with USB, HDMI and NFC capabilities for my convenience. Only when I leaving my Q suite, I had to carefully remove the plug from the charger. But not a really big problem, isn't it? In addition to the electronic shelf and the table above, 
there is a storage compartment and a large armrest. A bottle of water and noise cancellation headphones were waiting for me under the lid. Good to know. The table is significantly larger and the queue suite in the direction of flight. Even without the closed door, there is enormous privacy. I can hardly see other guests when the door is open. When the door is closed, then 100% privacy is given. If I press the Do Not Disturb button, I will not be disturbed by the crew. My white illuminated sign, the seat number, is changed into red. Thanks to super fluffy pillows and extra thick blankets, you can sleep very well. Still much better is that if you ask the crew to make the bed. An extra layer and it becomes even softer. D&D sign on, close door and sleep excellent. By the way, take a look at our channel, our own playlist with first in business class flights and Stefan's creative English language. The service on board is outstanding. I felt the crew was specially trained for the Q-Suite. Qatar Airways set standards in business class, the same quality for over 10 flights. Even if the crew is not in a good mood, the service does not suffer. But Qatar increases the service in the Q-Suite again to significant points. Besides the well-known food at any time, what you want comes more. In the Q-Suite there's an insert in the menu, snack platters or little bites called. As you can see visually appealing prepared and taste excitingly delicious. Business class passengers receive a Briggs hardcover kit with Castello Montevibiano amenities along with an eye mask, earplugs and socks. Toothbrushes and razors are available in the laboratories as usual. Unfortunately, there are no new large amenity kit. These are only issued on A380 flights. At the edge, the small pillow is a thought as gift to take home with. Personally, I think the Oryx Entertainment System is one of the best on the market. With so far every cutter flight I could use this intuitive. There was always a very large number of current films available in German and English. Other languages are also available. In the Q-Suite is even more. The 21.5 inch monitor is really huge. Since active noise cancellation headphones have made even more fun to enjoy blockbusters. Overall, I have to say, the Q-Suite is our current favorite product on the market. Qatar Airways does not exaggerate with the slogan, first in business. Who flies this extra class gets a terrific flight experience. Not only the privacy, but all the extras make the Q-Suite. The increased service, the little bits and the large monitor, the large and soft pillows, the extra thick blanket and the mega soft bed. Altogether, probably the best business class product currently. What do you think? Please leave a comment. And there's one more thing. Thanks to Doran, he has done an exceptional service and a magnificent flight experience for us. Please don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Leave a comment. Thanks for watching. See you next time.